This is Shannon Keatsman presenting Mathematics Education Societies in the United States for OCU STEM Math 570 History of Math, Dr. Amy Barrett. Whether a teacher of mathematics, a mathematician, an engineer, or anyone else who utilizes mathematics on a regular basis, becoming aware of professional organizations that are related to the field of mathematics is beneficial. By examining each of these organizations and exploring their differences, those who work in the field of mathematics can more effectively determine which, if any, of these organizations are worthy of membership. Four of the mathematics organizations that are long-standing, reputable organizations with a great deal to share with their members are the American Mathematical Society, Mathematical Association of America, National Council of Teachers of Mathematics, and Society for Industrial Applied Mathematics. This presentation strives to explore each of these organizations further by analyzing the mission of each organization, discussing the activities in which each organization enge engages, considering the focus of each organization, and then exploring the differences and future impact of the organizations as a whole. Founded in 1888 by Thomas Fisk, the American Mathematical Society was originally known as the New York Mathematical Society. Fisk was inspired to form the society after witnessing the London Mathematical Society while visiting England. Shortly after its founding, the Society began publishing the Bulletin of the New York Mathematical Society, which successfully helped to increase the organization's membership. In 1894, the Society reorganized and changed its name to the American Mathematical Society. That same year, Char Charlotte Scott served as the first woman counsel for the Society. Scott was also the first woman to join the Society when she became a member in 1891. Julia Robinson later became the first president of the Society when she obtained the position in, 18, in 1983, though her term was cut short in 1984 after she was diagnosed with leukemia. The American Mathematical Society made an impact on the field of mathematics education when it called for the creation of a new teaching degree in 1954. Called the Doctor of Arts in Mathematics, the degree was similar to a PhD without requiring a research thesis. The Society continues to contribute to the field of mathematics with its journal, the American Mathematical Society, which was created in 1988. The Society also works in cooperation with the Mathematical Association of America and other organizations to hold the joint mathematics meeting each year in January. The annual event is the world's largest research mathematics meeting, with more than 6,600 people attending the 2013 event. The organization co-sponsors other meetings with international mathematical societies throughout the year. Comprised of 29 regional sections throughout the United States, the Mathematical Association of America fo focuses on activities and events that are designed to make mathematics more accessible to individuals at the undergraduate level. In addition to hosting regular meetings at each of its 29 regional sections, the organization also sponsors the annual Summer Math Fest and co-sponsors the Joint Mathematics Meeting along with the American Mathematical Society. The MAA also publishes numerous journals, including the American Mathematical Monthly, Mathematics Magazine, the College of Mathematics Journal, Math Horizons, and MAA Focus. The American Mathematical Monthly and the Math Horizons are both aimed at undergraduate students, while Mathematics Magazine and the College Mathematics Journal is aimed at teachers of undergraduate mathematics. MAA focuses, Focus is a newsletter sent to all association members. In addition to publishing journals, the MAA publishes the Online Mathematical Sciences Digital Library, which features online journals and classroom tools. The MAA also reaches out to undergraduate students via numerous competitions. Among these are the William Lowell Putnam exam for undergraduate students, the American Mathematics competitions for middle school and high school students, and the online interstellar competition series. The AMC competition identifies outstanding students who are then invited to participate in the Mathematical Olympiad program where six high schools are ultimately selected to represent the United States in competition. The MAA also distributes numerous prizes to deserving students and teachers. Among these are the Carl B. Allendorfer Award, the Euler Book Prize Award, the Lester R. Ford Award, and the Chauvinat Prize. Founded in 1920, the National Council of Teachers of Mathematics is the largest mathematics education organization in the world. With more than 80,000 members around the world, the mission of the NCTM is to serve as the voice of mathematics education while supporting teachers through professional development, leadership, and research. To accomplish its mission, the NCTM publishes five journals, Teaching Children Mathematics, Mathematics Teaching in the Middle School, Mathematics Teacher Educator, Mathematics Teacher, and the Journal for Research in Mathematics Education. The NCTM has also published a series of math standards for the United States and Canada, having developed the Curriculum and Evaluation Standards for School Mathematics in 1989, followed by the Professional Standards for Teaching Mathematics in 1991, the Assessment Standards for School Mathematics in 1995, and then the Principles and Standards for School Mathematics in 2000. The Principles and Standards for School Mathematics is considered to be less controversial 
than previous standards list as the final publication received input from teachers, educational researchers, and mathematicians. These standards revolve around the six principles of equity curriculum, teaching, learning, assessment, and technology, as well as 10 strands within the five content areas of number and operations, algebra, geometry, measurement, and data analysis and probability. In its ongoing attempt to align mathematics education throughout the United States, the NCTM released its curriculum focal points for pre-kindergarten through grade 8 mathematics, a quest for coherence in 2006. The publication identified the most important mathematical topics that need to be addressed at each grade level. In addition to listing specific skills, the publication listed concepts, procedures, and related ideas that need to be addressed at each grade level in order to develop a strong foundation of mathematics that will lead to long-term understanding and learning. Among the process standards emphasized in the publication are reasoning, communication, representation, connections, and problem solving. Curriculum focal points for pre-kindergarten through grade 8 mathematics, a quest for coherence, was one of the key documents used in the creation of the Common Core Standards released in 2010. Founded by a small group of mathematicians in 1951, the Society for Industrial and Applied Mathematics originally focused on providing a forum for exchanging ideas about mathematics and industry. Since its founding, the organization has grown to more than 14,000 members throughout the world, but they focus on applied industrial and computational mathematics. The society is comprised mostly of industrial mathematicians, scientists, engineers, and academic mathematicians. In order to, prom to promote discussions and collaborations, the society includes a number of activity groups. It also publishes 20 to 25 books per year, a newsletter, and numerous journals. These journals include Multi-Scale Modeling and Simulation, SIAM Journal on Applied Dynamical Systems, SIAM Journal on Applied Mathematics, SIAM Journal on, co on Computing, SIAM Journal on Control and Optimization, SIAM Journal on Discrete Mathematics, SIAM Journal on Financial Mathematics, SIAM Journal on Imaging Sciences, SIAM Journal on Mathematical Analysis, SIAM Journal on Matrix Analysis on Applications, SIAM Journal on Numerous Analysis, Analysis, SIAM Journal on Optimization, SIAM Journal on Scientific Computing, SIAM slash ASA Journal on Uncertainty Quantification, SIAM Review and Theory of Probability and its Applications. In addition, the organization organizes a number of meetings and conferences throughout the year while also recognizing mathematicians and computational scientists, scientists with prizes including the German Dahlquist Prize, the Ralph E. Kleinman Prize, the J.D. Crawford Prize, and the Richard C. DePrima Prize. To encourage high school students to pursue their interest in mathematics, SIAM also organizes Moody's Mega Math Challenge each year. The event, which gives away $100,000 in scholarship funds each year, is a mathematics modeling competition for high school students residing in the East Coast. The American Mathematical Society, Mathematical Association of America, National Council of Teachers of Mathematics, and Society for Industrial and Applied Mathematics are all organizations that focus on the advancement of mathematics. While each organization oversees some form of publication, the number of publications and the focus of each publication varies from one organization to the next. The National Council of Teachers of Mathematics and Society, for example, focuses on publications that are meant to assist teachers with more effectively teaching mathematics in the classroom. The Mathematical Association of America places most of its emphasis on providing pertinent information to undergraduate students who are pursuing a degree in mathematics, while the Society for Industrial and Applied Mathematics is geared more toward professionals who are already employed in a field related to mathematics. The American Mathematical Society takes a more holistic approach as it touches on all aspects of mathematics, ranging from mathematics education to the latest research in the field of mathematics. While the future impact of each of these organizations is not clear, it does appear as though the Council of Teachers of Mathematics and Society will continue to play a dominant role in the field of mathematics education. Their research has already had a significant impact on the development of Common Core, which has been officially adopted by 42 states in the District of Columbia. Many schools within states that have not adopted Common Core have also chosen to utilize the curriculum in the classroom. Common Core has garnered a great deal of criticism as parents struggle to try to understand the homework that their children are bringing home and as they try to understand how this new method of teaching mathematics is beneficial to the student. Whether or not the Council of Teachers of Mathematics and Society develops another set of recommendations that further impact the Common Core standards remains to be seen. Regardless of the focus of each organization, one thing remains abundantly clear. The United States remains behind other developed countries in terms of STEM education and the number of people who are pursuing careers in a STEM field. Therefore, these organizations must continue to spread awareness of mathematics while conducting research and assisting those who are interested in or who are already employed in a field related to mathematics. It is only in this way that the United States will be able to successfully push itself into the next century with a solid foundation in the field of mathematics.